Hi, so let's talk about how you can turn off orange dot on your iPhone. So if you're on your iPhone and you see orange dot on the top right corner, so basically it means that something is using your microphone. So I'll walk you through the process of turning it off. But first, please hit the subscribe button because it really helps. Thank you guys. So if you see an orange dot on your top right corner, that means that something is using your microphone. So right now I'm on my iPhone and as you can see that on the top right corner, there is an orange dot. So basically it is indicating that something is using my microphone. Now the good thing is that I can swipe it down from the right and then I will see that system icon at the very top. So I can tap on that. So it will tell me what is using my microphone. So for now, system is using my microphone because I'm screen recording it. But let's say if I open voice memos and start recording again. Now voice memos is also using the microphone. So let me show you if it shows or not. As you can see, it is showing that voice memos and system is using my microphone. So this is quite useful in the case that if th any third party app is using your microphone, you can turn it off. So how you can turn it off? So there are two ways. So one is a very simple way that you just swipe up. So here are the apps that might be using your microphone. So once you have checked which app is using, you can just close it by swiping up. But now if you permanently want to stop the third party apps from using your microphone or camera, so what you can do is that you can go into your settings, scroll down, go into your apps, and here you will see all the apps. So you can custom select which apps should not use your microphone. So let's say I opened Snapchat, so I can just turn off its microphone and I can also toggle off its camera. So it will never be able to access my microphone without my permissions. So basically that's how you do that. So there are other apps too, but uh, this will apply only to the third party apps. So if you have any unnecessary apps, you can basically restrict those apps from here or you can just install, uninstall those apps. So I hope it helped. If it did, please consider subscribing and liking to this channel and I'll see you in the next one.